I want to show you a couple of fun hustler shots, some old shots that have been around for a really long time. You can have some fun with your friends at home or if you go to a pool room and you want to show off a little bit. There's just nothing to these shots but knowledge, so I'm going to try to give you that. The first one, what I'm going to try to do is make this combination, the 10-3 into the corner pocket. Now it looks easy enough. All you're doing is shooting the cue ball into the 10. Both balls are frozen together. They're touching each other and they're touching the rail. All I am to do is shoot this cue ball into the 10 and look what happens to the three. It'll miss every single time. You can have your friends try it as many times as they want to. They're gonna miss the shot. What you know, on the other hand, is that what it needs to have is a little bit of, um, a little bit of spit right between the two balls. You just wet it a little bit Put a little wet spot right there, line these two up, and now th that you have wet the contact point, watch what happens. Same exact setup, same speed, same shot, only this time when you shoot it, the three ball goes straight into the pocket. Now the second hustler shot I'm going to do, this one I call the faster than the eye, and I'm going to just make one ball, this one's a little trickier, you may have to practice it a little bit. Shoot the eight ball into the corner pocket. Only the one ball is going to be blocking about half the pass. Half the one ball is going to be right in the way of me making that eight. So what I have to do here is put a little trick on this one. So you really have to pay attention. Like I said, this one's called faster than the eye. Here we go, eight ball, corner pocket. And it's just, just like that, perfect. Now, the problem with that shot is you don't want to use that in an actual tournament because as you see here, I'm going to shoot it in slow motion for you, you'll see what actually happens. I'm shooting right through. making the 10 ball in the corner pocket. Now what you have to do with that is hold way back on the cue stick. Instead of holding it here where you normally do, hold it way back, have a short bridge. That way you're starting back here and you can actually follow through all the way through, keep your eye on the ball you're trying to make and you should be able to pull it off. But like I said, don't try that in an actual match. I don't think your opponent would like it.